Happy Halloween from Time to Cook with Susan Beck. Well, we have reached October and it's time for that special holiday with haunting treats and gory meals. As my kids were growing up, we always made some kind of Halloween dishes for supper on the night of Halloween. And tonight I'm gonna to show you two of the simple little treats that you can make just by buying some pretzel sticks and some um, Hershey's miniature peanut butter cups, just those tiny little ones, along with a second recipe using some fudge strike cookies, or these are the Craven brands, and we're gonna be flipping them over and using the brown side with a Hershey's Kiss on top. This will become a witch's hat and our pretzel sticks and our peanut butter cups will be the witch's broom sticks. So all we need besides these four purchased ingredients is a little bit of powdered sugar frosting. For our simple powdered sugar frosting, I have like half a tablespoon of butter. Butter or margarine would be fine. I don't need a whole lot of frosting, so I'm just gonna go with one cup of powdered sugar, that half a tablespoon of butter, and I'm going to add a little bit of milk. I'm going to start with just a half a tablespoon. I'll probably end up using a little more, but we do not want our powdered sugar frosting to be very runny. And today I'm not even gonna mess around with a mixer. I'm just going to mix this by hand. This is such an easy, activity to use with small children just because most of the items that we're using are already made and you really could even buy your frosting if you wanted to. And I am going to add the other half a tablespoon of milk for a total of about one tablespoon milk. Just need something to moisten it up a bit. Since it is Halloween, I think purple or orange frosting is kind of fitting, although the white is just fine as well. So there's two drops of blue and two drops of red, and red and blue should give us purple frosting. Stir that around a little bit. Oh, we're getting a nice purple color there. So today we'll start with those witch's hats. And the first thing I need to do is unwrap some of the Hershey's Kisses. You can use any kind of kisses you want. Today I just happen to have the plain chocolate, milk chocolate Hershey Kisses. So we'll just make maybe like six of these right now. I thought maybe I'd surprise my college kids and drop these in the mail to them so they can get a few Halloween treats off at school. All right, next thing is I need a fudge stripe or one of these Craven shortbread cookies flipped upside down so that I have the black side. So this will go together with the brown on brown. And we're going to just put a little dab of frosting. I think it works best to put it on the Hershey Kiss. And then the reason I like the color is when I press down, then I get a little swirl of purple color underneath the kiss. It kind of gives the hat, this little witch's hat, a decorative look. All right, there's number three. And one more. Hershey's Kiss has the frosting, twist it around on there, and you have a beautiful little witch's hat. Sure to delight many trick-or-treaters. You can see here that I only made up six witch's hats so far, but you can see that that one cup of powdered sugar has given me enough frosting to probably make at least 24 witch's hats. So I'll make a few more later. Let's instead look at our second little treat. So we're just gonna use the pretzel sticks. We want the ones that are the stick because these are going to become the witch's broomstick. 
So again, we need to open up our Reese's Peanut Butter Cups, just like we did with the Hershey's, taking off all of the wrappers, including that brown wrinkly base to the bottom of the peanut butter cup. My kids have used these a lot when they've had treats um, needed for 4-H meetings or anything during the month of October. Quick and easy, and everyone loves all these good candies. So we'll just make a few of these as well. There we go. And this is just so unbelievably easy. Just into the center, you press down a stick. And these are our witch's broomsticks. Here's all you do. Take your miniature Reese's peanut butter cup and press in a pretzel stick. Miniature peanut butter cup and a pretzel stick. And there we have a cute tray of Halloween treats. So if you're looking for a quick way to make a little Halloween dessert or looking for something to do with the kids, any kid of any age almost can make these witches hats and witches broomsticks just in time for Halloween.